you really had the impression you were squished into a bottle and being shaken in every direction. <laughs> Nicola Violand and his fellow cavers have now been trapped for almost 24 hours. So far, the air pressure has held steady. But they're in for the shock of their lives. Upstream in another part of the cave system, some debris breaks loose. As the blockage clears, there's a sudden dangerous drop in air pressure, then a powerful surge of water. The moment the water goes down, it goes down fast. Faster than it rose. On a la cage thoracique qui est prise. Our torsos were shaking and trembling. Our ears were blocked. You really had the impression you were squished into a bottle and being shaken in every direction. As the water level drops, the men clamber onto a ledge that had been submerged until now. It was like a whirlpool that was going to suck us down underwater, bash us into the walls, and drown us in the current. The sudden draining of the water disrupts the pressure in the gallery and creates a bizarre phenomenon. For a period of nearly 10 minutes, multiple waves batter the inside of the cavern. The noise was absolutely infernal. We were really in the middle of the elements that were in a fury.